Hey boys and girls, welcome back. How are you doing today? Told you I'd be dropping another one, and I'm probably gonna be dropping another one now. This. This is gonna be kind of a really short one, okay? I'm gonna try to keep it as short as I can simply because this involves just uh, just a little testing and investigation on my own uh, involving a comment that was left on one of my videos on the uh, Bond Arms Rough and Rowdy 45-410 Derringer. Um, I had a lot of good comments on it. In fact, I don't think I got any bad ones. I don't get many bad ones. I try to be everybody's friend in the woke world. <laughs> How's that make you feel? Anyway, I hope it makes you feel soft, warm, and fuzzy. The, the comment that was left uh, by a... Uh, um, what was his name? Hello America. It was a very short, very concise statement. And it was on the last video I did in the Rough and Rowdy series, the very last one. It's still in my playlist if you want to go see the video. Um, but he left a comment, very short, very concise. Um, let me see. How did he... How did he put that... Okay. My rough and rowdy did not penetrate two plastic plates from the Dollar Tree. That's it. Uh, so I have very little information to go on as far as what kind of plastic plates, what load he was shooting, what distance he was shooting. It's just a straight out statement that the 45, 410, rough and rowdy, would not penetrate two plastic plates from the Dollar Tree. Now, as fate would have it, there is actually a Dollar Tree in Minko, Oklahoma, <laughs> which is the closest town to me. And so, I, you know, I, this piqued my interest. I'm, I'm a curious animal by nature, just like cats and deer and, well, humans. And I thought, you know, I wonder what the hell he was shooting, because I left a reply to it stating that maybe I ought to go to Dollar Tree and pick up a shitload of plastic plates, and that way I can have me some fuel expedient body armor on the cheap. Because if a 45 won't go through two plastic plates, that's some pretty good shit, right? Well, guess what? Dollar Tree in the town in which I shop, and it's a very windy day today, has plastic plates. They have absolutely two variations on plastic plates. They have these white, soft, pliable plastic plates that are like Frisbees, more or less. And they have these hard plastic plates. No give, no flex, just straight, hard plate. Well, that's the only two they had, so that's all I've got to test with. But they are from Dollar Tree, and I do have two of them each. And let's find out if the rough and rowdy 45 long coat will penetrate two plates because according to his statement it wouldn't let's check it out all right our first set of two plates uh plastic two each soft and pliable dollar tree issue bond arms 45 Colt, rough and rowdy. Uh, let's find out. Will a 45 go through them? I don't see an issue with that. Stand by and let's get them other two. What do you say? No, righty then. Obviously, soft and pliable. Right on through, baby. So, um, hard and rigid. Let's see what we get from that. Jesus! I think it's safe to say mine goes right through. Now, maybe he had what one might call, you know, in a 
Freudian sense of way a, uh, a weak load. <laughs> but that's possible, right? That's possible. So, just to make sure, let's do something here. Um, just having to bring a little extra ammo. But I'm probably going to have a rat shit hard time getting into because I don't like this shit coming apart in my pocket. Yes. Well, if I needed this in a gunfight, I'd be... F wouldn't I? <laughs> a gunfight with a two-shot Derringer. Right, Brad. Right. But we only need one round, right? All four plates. According to his experience, it wouldn't get through two. See if it gets through four. It gets through four. <laughs> hole one, hole two. <laughs> It gets through four. Yeah. Well, hello America. One can only imagine that it's quite possible that you were using a somewhat weak load or maybe you were further away from the target than one might want to utilize a two and a half inch barrel two shot Derringer four. About 17 feet is what their instructions say really not far at all but here we have the scientific evidence but I appreciate you stopping by if you see this video I'd like to know more because my experimentation has quantifiably trashed your statement you folks have a great day stand by There'll be some more stuff coming later on in the week coming at you from the middle of nowhere and uh loving it <laughs> out in the sticks i'm brad i love you guys pass it on come back and see me and i'll be seeing you somewhere down range bye All right, our first set of plates, plastic, soft and pliable, Dollar Tree issue, and a 45 rough and ratty bond arms. Do it penetrate or do it not penetrate? I know loaded that bitch. I think it's safe to say windy days just suck for trying to do something on camera. <laughs> <laughs>